But given the danger oh. that it's guarding against, it's not an unreasonable intrusion. And it can be the same thing with acquiring uh, this data that, that, that is regarded as effects. Depends on how. And, and, and that's why I say it's, it's foolish to have us make the decision, because I don't know how serious the danger is. All right, let's stop there. That's right. It's like, who makes the decision of what the danger is? The NSA, the CIA, openly set up by the globalists, openly set up to take over the country, openly running Al-Qaeda. And you have these soft sellouts of the system, Scalia, who's a lawyer and knows that's pure treason. You know, if there's a danger, we can do whatever we want. Really, that was never accepted before. You got a better chance of dying from honeybee sting every year than from terrorist. Look it up. Even Esquire did an article on that last year. Deer jumping out in front of your car kills more people than terrorists. They don't care, though. It's this perception of we're going to protect you. Hypothetically, somebody could do a mass shooting on a highway. We need checkpoints on the highway. Now, remember what the BBC put out last year, and then the Boston Globe also ran a similar headline, and we're putting it on screen right now. Is the U.S. Declaration of Independence illegal? And they go on to say, maybe it's even terrorist. Because it dares to say you have a right to stand up against a government. I mean, this is, there's another headline. Is the Declaration of Independence unconstitutional? This is not a joke. This is what the system is pushing. Because they're overthrowing everything. They've got to make it look normal. So they have one of the justices of the Supreme Court go on C-SPAN in front of a whole room of lawyers and say, no, there's no absolute. We can have the NSA spying grabbing everybody's data, we can grope you. Really, it's always been totally illegal, so the government lied about it. Now they get caught, they go, oh, we're allowed to. This is a revolution of tyrants and authoritarians against us, and it's been going pretty well. So finally, you get 52 families driven out of business, even though they had the grazing rights under state and federal law, before the BLM existed. BLM comes along and arbitrarily says, you will pay us all this. A federal court last year in Nevada said that very BLM was, quote, in a criminal conspiracy. Kit Daniels wrote an article about that on Friday, but it's been in all the mainstream news. But the media won't cover it. It's in a vacuum that last year, headline, federal judge says BLM involved in criminal conspiracy in Nevada. Well, they are in a criminal conspiracy to run people off their land, just like the coal power plants that are totally clean, supply half our energy. They used to. And they're shutting them down all over the country. And Obama says, I'm going to raise taxes to the point that bankrupts you. That's our goal. Our goal is to use taxes outside of law because Congress won't pass a law to do this. So I'm going to use taxes to destroy you. But I'm going to give General Electric and four other companies waivers so they can operate coal power plants. But nobody else can. So on top of using taxes to destroy people, they let their crooked friends operate. What do you think is going to happen in an economy like that? It's going to be just like New York City and mob-run areas. You're not going to have a business unless the mob basically owns it, and you're going to be their slave and have to kiss their butt all day. I don't want to live in a country like that. I mean, if some mobster showed up at my office and said, you pay me money or I'm going to come after your family, folks, I would knock their teeth in right there on the spot. There's a reason the mafia never fly in Texas, because people will kill you if you try to go around telling people what to do. Guarantee anybody in my family, growing up, my grandfathers especially, somebody came to their house saying, give me money, my grandfathers would kill you on the spot. And it wasn't because they were these great guys. These were guys that taught Sunday school. These are guys that played football with Tom Landry. These are guys that flew B-17s, you know, over Europe. These are guys that opened doors for little ladies. My grandfathers would kill someone the minute they did that. They would kill you. And it wasn't because they were violent, evil, bad people. It was because they weren't slaves, ladies and gentlemen. And they understood. But no, we would do that. 
Hell, if you put a mobster in a uniform and they came and said, bring your daughter out here, the average American would bring their daughter out and bend her over a barrel. And if the cop said, stab your daughter in the head with an ice pick, the average American would do it. Because in this country, people worship the state and blind authority. We're going to go to break and come back with Vic, Josh, Tom, John, Anthony, and others. Briefly. This broadcast is funded by listeners and viewers like you. We don't take your money at gunpoint like NPR. We get it when you support us so I can hire more reporters, have more people, be able to send more people out in the field for historical Boston bombing coverage, uh, you know, the coverage you've seen uh, with uh, uh, the Bundy situation, all of it. Become a PrisonPlanet.tv member. Become a PrisonPlanet.tv member today. 11 people can use your membership. You're funding the tip of the spear in the info war. We're risking our lives to bring you this information. Make no mistake. PrisonPlanet.tv. Call. Get the Pro 1 G-Tube filters. Blow away all of their gravity fed filters. Look at the side-by-side -side comparisons. InfoWarsStore.com. Get the high-quality supplements. InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWarsHealth.com. Fund us so we can be strong and continue on and hopefully expand in the face of the enemy. PrisonPlanet.tv. Become a member today. We'll be back. How can you save a ton of money and prepare for emergencies? By having your own in-home freeze dryer from Harvest Right. Now you can cut down on wasted food by freeze drying your leftovers. That's right. Create your own long-term food storage by freeze drying your own fruits, meats, vegetables, even complete meals with the Harvest Right in-home freeze dryer. Imagine the savings and the peace of mind. See how the amazing Harvest Right freeze dryer works at HarvestRight.com. Hey, this is Steve Sanchez. Worried about the Wall Street Casino? Yeah, me too. Wondering when the stock market is going to collapse? You probably want answers, but you know you can't trust the global elite. Well, my good friend Brett Kitchen, best-selling author, has created a DVD set called The Millionaire Black Box. And for a limited time, you get free access. Call 1-800-259-3131. Find out how the global elite invests without having to deal with the global elite themselves. 1-800-259-3131. 1-800-259-3131. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. Hi there. My name is Frank Bates. What I'm about to tell you in the next 60 seconds could get me in a lot of trouble. I just created a free video presentation at 123coverup.com that exposes the electricity monopolies and government agencies for what they really are. Incompetent, lying crooks that are counting on your ignorance and fear to keep your power bills criminally high. Some have called this a conspiracy. Others have called it a cover-up, and you will be shocked to find out how deep the conspiracy goes. My video at 123coverup.com exposes the truth and shows you the secret of how I beat them and how you can beat them too. Watch the controversial video that thousands of other smart patriots have already seen in the last three months. Go to 123coverup.com and discover one weird trick to slash your power bill and protect your home. Go watch my video now at 123coverup.com before they force me to shut it down. Again, that's 123coverup.com. Let's go right to your phone calls in this segment. The next, I had a Bundy joining us. Talk for just one segment, and then we'll go back to your calls and get into how scared the Clintons were of the American people having the internet as a communication tool. And that's why they want to bring in cybersecurity now to shut down free speech, so they can just rob and steal whatever they want. Vic in Illinois, you're on the air. Go ahead. Alex. Hey, go ahead. Hey, man, it's a great day to be able to talk to you, sir. Uh, 
I uh, wanted to just kind of go along the lines of what you're talking about, you know, with what people are willing to put up with. And, you know, I've been in this uh, kind of uh, truth movement or whatever you want to call it for a number of years now. And, I, you know, when I first got into it, I was just, PMA, just you know, exploding on everybody, you know, pointing them in your direction, telling them what was going on. And, uh, you know, now it's got to the point where it's like, you know, I, I listen to people and I see them online and I see generally that a lot of people, they don't even know what they're talking about for the most part. They just kind of believe whatever they want to believe. And also, you know. Um, well, yeah, what's happened is people are either awakening or they don't believe the system anymore, but they don't know what to believe. They're just going in all different directions. Exactly. And also I've uh, encountered a lot of people who generally they kind of want to be dominated by these people. You know, I'm, I'm looking, I'm reading, you know, I'm listening. Well, no, to I mean, they have Stockholm Syndrome. That They feel so disempowered that they think at least they have the power to grovel to the black boots. You know, corporations, they, you know, the, the controlling powers in, in the world, they, they literally seek out psychopaths to run things. Sure, sure. My question today to the listeners was, and I really am asking you this, uh, Vic, is, is there any amount of tyranny that we have a right to stand up against? Obviously, we have a right to stand up anytime we want against tyranny. But but I'm throwing the question out there. I'm begging the question. Uh, I mean, is there any level of tyranny that people won't put up with? What is your line in the sand? Well, I think Bondi has a, is a great example uh, for people to really stand behind and get behind and really just start a movement to just kind of abolish uh, property taxes altogether because they are unconstitutional. If I'm, am, I, am I correct on that? Absolutely. I mean, it's right out of the Communist Manifesto, uh, property taxes. I appreciate your call. Um, here's the Christian Science Monitor uh, reporting on the range war, and I have one here uh, as well out of the Las Vegas uh, paper. Uh, there's several articles. In fact, it's up on Drudge. I'm looking for it uh, in my stack. It's a cowboy hat. Uh, on Drudge, it says Western states move to take over federal land. And uh, the headline is Nevada Range War. Western states move to take over federal land. Uh, and it gets into the fact that uh, more than 50 state legislators from different states met uh, and discussed the fact that uh, they're moving to try to take away the federal land, because it's not federal land. I mean, you look at Texas, one or two percent is federal. You look at um, places like Nevada, it's close to 90 percent. And the feds don't own this. They don't pay taxes. They don't produce. They just drive around with paramilitary police and point guns at us. I mean, I was at Big Bend a few weeks ago and had one run-in with somebody in a uniform, and they literally walked over and said, what are you doing? And I was sitting there by the Rio Grande River, sitting there. And I said, excuse me? He goes, what are you doing? And he just kept staring at me with his hand on his gun. I just ignored him. And he sat there smiling at me and then left. It was bizarre. It was like when you go to a party and some weirdo who's mentally ill is there and they, they're acting strange. You, you don't understand what their, what, what their point is. I mean, imagine somebody that wants a gun and a badge so they can run around messing with people. It, it, it's just, it, it's the essence of tyranny. We'll be right back with more of your phone calls. What is your line in the sand? Stay with us. Thank you for listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. This is Alex Jones for InfoWarsLife.com. The latest in preparedness is now here. An electrically stabilized colloidal silver solution that can be added to both your home cabinet and preparedness pack alike. Concentrated to 30 parts per million in what has been dubbed the Survival Silver Solution. The new InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver is the answer for you and your family. And it's entirely free of toxic artificial additives that are loaded into many products. The InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Silver is so powerful that it is concentrated into a two-ounce bottle and is not recommended 
grade or extended continual use. This is not a low grade formula. We are working with one of the top laboratory manufacturers in the United States to bring you the best form of colloidal silver using electrical processes within a base of deionized water. For your preparedness storage or your home kitchen, purchase your bottle of InfoWarsLife.com Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver today and find other amazing supplements at InfoWarsLife.com. 